Hey guys, Ken Ross here and I'm a business consultant that specializes in reducing costs for businesses by looking at their essential expenses and today I'd like to talk to you about something that every business needs and really can't afford, can't afford to pay for and that's this, time. Every business needs time. Every business would like to have more time to focus on the things that are relevant to their business. How do, you, how do you do that? You either have to increase your amount of resources that can dedicate more time towards those efforts, or you have to do it yourself. And so that's really what this is about for me. The, the whole journey of how do you maximize the time that you have, right? As a business owner or as a person who wants to operate a business, you need to spend the time as the owner in the right areas. How do you know that that is the right area of, time, of focus for your, your business or, or that you're spending the right amount of time on one type of action versus another? You actually need to measure it. You need to set goals. You need to be able to look at the return on those investments of that time. So timekeeping right, is something that a lot of big businesses talk a lot about. right? And the reason they do that is because they want to know how much time it takes for their resources to actually deliver a product. And then they want to equate that product with how much they're charging, right, to see if the return is there or not. And that is something that as a small business owner, as a business who, who operates under maybe some different st stresses, doesn't have the time to do. And so that's something I want you to consider is how do you, how do you maximize your time to get a good return? And I, I can give you at least one example, at least that I'm very much in favor of, and that is give me the time to look into your bills. And the reason why I say that is this, it doesn't really cost you more time than it would take to, to have a conversation with me, right? Once you have that conversation, I spend the time and I take the efforts of taking the time to look more involved and more in depth into your expenses and the return on that investment is something that you can easily calculate. And, and understand, because if you were to take the time yourself to do this, right, and I've, I've given you some, some tips, and I want you to go ahead and take a look at what it takes for you as a business owner to maximize your output on your essential expenses. So I'm going to actually send you a link to the card. It's going to show up right here on how you can save money today on your business expenses. Love you to take a look at that, and then I'd love for you to equate how much time you think it would take to do every step of that process, because those steps and all the steps that I take in that process is something that I am very much invested in, very much want to for my business owners to take the time in doing for them, because in the end, the return is great for both of us, right? It's a win-win situation that's actually a triple win, because not only do the business owner and myself win, but the vendor or the person that you establish your relationship with that provides you that service, they win as well because they have a stronger customer that has the services that they need for the price that it's worth. And that is something that you cannot place a value to. You can certainly see how much you re would receive in a, in a return, right, on this adventure, but as far as what value it brings to your business, it brings you peace of mind in the sense that you don't have to worry about whether or not you're wasting time by talking to me or talking to your vendor or sorting out what it is you need for your particular product or particular service that you're looking into, right? That time you know is valuable. You know it's being spent well because in the end, it's gonna be relevant to your business and you're going to be able to leverage that to maximize your, your effectiveness in your business. And so that's what I have today. I'd love to hear what you have to think about time. It's something that I ultimately see very much value in that maybe more people don't see value in. A lot of people spend time networking and talking to their colleagues in business and, and, and really trying to grow a business, you know, with the relationships they have. And that's certainly great too. But how do you maximize your time in some of these areas that are a little bit more, more or less hard to equate a, a value to, right? This is one of those things. So love to hear your comments, your thoughts in the comments section below. Would love it if you're not subscribed to this channel to please subscribe. Would love to hear from you um, and, and see you on a regular basis. Um, I would love to actually have a great conversation about time and what it is you think 
time really ma matters to you in your business. So go ahead and put that in the comments section below, as well as tell your friends about this channel. Would love to see this channel grow. I'm, I'm setting some, some very ambitious goals as far as trying to push my uh, viewership and su subscriber base. So I'm going to be pushing out more and more content as uh, the time goes along. And along that lines, I would love it if you could give me topics to cover. I know I cover a lot of different things. It may seem like uh, a lot of these things are random, but they really aren't in the sense that I love to look at business and the various aspects of business and then tell, ask myself a question. What do I think is most important at this time, right? And so I spend some time thinking about you know, the crisis in you, the Ukraine and, and how that is affecting business and, and 5G. And I've, I've come out and I've, I've interrupted kind of this normal flow of, of different things that I'm doing to bring that content as soon as I feel like it's important. And that is something I really do feel like for this channel is needed. If you provide me some feedback on, hey, I'd really love to hear about X, Y, or Z, guess what? You can almost guarantee or I guarantee it to you that I will try my best to cover it very quickly after you say something. So please, would love to hear what you have to say, what it is you'd like to hear me talk about more or have some, some insight on or bring some insight to you. And so, yeah, would love that. Please also find me on different social media platforms by going to my website, IamKenRoss.com. And until next time, I'll see you around.